I'm back again, YouTube. Um, I did forget to show some books. Um, I, I don't know how I forgot to show these. Cause I just got them like two days ago. And I'm not going to show every single one. Well, maybe I'll go through them. Who knows? Uh, but yeah, so uh, I picked up a, a complete collection of Ghost Rider Volume 1. Um, and I also got uh, some other books, a few other books that I needed. Um, the Marvel Spotlight, you know, I have number five and number six, which I don't feel like I, I got to find them in my collection, but they also have these too. Um, number seven, number eight, number nine, now, uh, number nine, and number 11. Now, uh, I'm missing number 10 now, that's the only one I'm missing. The next, uh, that that's all the Ghost Rider, um, in Marvel Spotlight, uh, at least, um, so all I need is number 10. They had a number 10, but it was in really, really bad shape. So I didn't want that one. These aren't in great shape either. They're all mid-range, mid-grade books. So, but I did want them, so I got them. And then I also got the complete set, you know. I'll tell you what I paid for them first. You know, for everything, I paid 230. So I think that's a pretty good. Um, I know I've seen a complete collection online of Ghost Rider Volume 1 from number one to, I mean, just the books themselves, they're, they're, there's 81 in volume one. So uh, I've seen them online for $400 for a complete set. You know, so I think for I paid 200 for the set and then another $30 for those other books. So, but yeah, uh, the Ghost Rider number one um, is actually in fairly decent condition. I would say it's probably around a six, six, five. Um, so, um, I don't know, I, 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 when, and they told me they had it, I was expecting, when I told them to give me a price for the whole set, I was expecting, uh, you know, a higher price, and they told me 200 I just grabbed it. Now, not every single one of these books is in great co uh, condition. Um, some of them are really rough, but they're books that I can pick up, you know, dollar bins or, you know, I'll find them somewhere in nicer condition. Some of them are pretty nice, though. Number two, I got two copies of number two. This one's in pretty rough shape, uh, but that one's in nicer, so I got two copies of that. Um, this is in rough shape, but uh, number three, it's definitely got a lot of wear on it. Um, number four, number five, Number six, this is uh, got a bunch of writing, got a date stamp on there and stuff. Uh, it's pretty rough, but. Number seven. Number eight. Number nine. Uh, that one's pretty rough. Number 10, that's also a little rough. It's not too bad though. Um, number 11. Number 12. Hmm. It's the first time I'm really going through every single one. Uh, number 13, a little rough. Kind of looks like I got some staining up here. So, number 14, yeah, some of these are pretty rough, but hey, I still think 200 bucks is not a bad deal. Number 15, I'm mean, gonna get the whole set and get it out of the way. I don't have to worry about digging through boxes. And 16, oh, that one's a big new new. Oh, that one's definitely gonna get a new one. That's uh, number 17 though. Uh, number 18. Number 19. Hey, at least number one is, is in good condition. Uh, number 20. Yeah, it looks like a lot of these are definitely mid grade at least. The most. Yeah, I don't think anything's above a mid grade copy. 22. 23. 24. 25, yeah, 26, well, maybe I should have looked a better look, I mean, I, um, I probably could have gotten that a little bit more than 200, um, 28, 29, 30, that was pretty nice, you know, some of these are getting, they're getting nicer looking, 31, 32. Let me uh, put these down. Just getting the 
This stick's getting pretty hot. Thick. Okay. Okay, 33. 34, that one's a little messed up. Yeah, they're back and forth. I guess whoever put this set together, 35, probably just pulled a bunch out of uh, back issue bin. I mean, like dollar bins and stuff, and didn't really care about the gray too much. This one's not too bad. Like I said, some of them are, I mean, yeah, definitely none of them are really over mid gray. Maybe a few of them. This one's pretty nice. 39. Mm -hmm. It looks like they're getting a little bit better as they go up, but 41, 42, but I think it's kind of cool that I can just, you know, like I said, get the whole set, 43, and I don't have to worry about searching through dollar bins or back issue bins. I have the whole set complete, and I actually can start reading them. Um, I mean, I really won't worry about too much about reading these books, uh, 44, 45. So, I can actually, these are all definitely reader copies and stuff, you know, um, nothing I would worry about. 46, you know, some of my books, my older books uh, that are in nicer condition and have a little value, I, I really don't want to touch them too much. Um, 47, so I, uh, if I really want to read it, I, I'll buy a trade or uh, like some of my, like the Adam books I got and stuff, I don't touch them, so I buy the, uh, um, showcase books and I got these for like five bucks a piece so it's not too bad but yeah these I'll read them 48 49 you know I, I never read the whole series so 50 I think when I was yeah when I was younger I read the one from the 90s or the 80s whatever it is um, 50 51 probably the late 80s and early 90s and 192 mean 52 53, yeah, these are definitely a little bit nicer. 54, eh, somewhat. <laughs> I'm going to stop saying that because then I'm going to pop up with a whole chunk missing out of it. 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, um, 61, you know, this is more just to, sh you know, in case you, I don't know, there, I don't really know a whole lot about, well, I mean, if there's any first appearances or anything like that, 62, um, I'm just showing them, why not, 62, 63, uh, my girlfriend's not around, so she went out for a little bit, my, my fiance, whatever, 64, so I got some time to make a video, because she's been home a lot recently, she's looking for another job, so, 64, 65, 66, 67, see if I can just make it all the way to the end, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, that's a pretty cool cover, um, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, and the last one, 81. So, that's the complete set. Uh, just wanted to show them all. I can't believe I forgot, you know, but like I said, mainly I got it because I wanted this one. And this is in, like I said, fairly nice condition. It's definitely a 5.6, you know, 5 or 6 around there. So I'm, I'm cool with that. And the rest of them are pretty rough, but oh well, it's a complete set. So, uh, oh, um, on my last video, I just made, uh, show my back, which I picked up this week. Um, I showed this still in the box. I took it out. Um, I thought it was a bobblehead, but I guess it's not. It's a Vinyl Vixen. Harley Quinn, and I guess they have a sort of Poison Ivy and a, and a Catwoman. Um, they're 25 bucks a piece. 
I don't, I don't know if I'll pick up the other ones. I just want the Harley Quinn one, so it's pretty cool looking. Um, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, so thanks guys for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.